I was reading recently, uh, you know, Justin Willis, obviously, uh, there was a lot of confusion of what happened with him. I wanted to get your side of the story. Now, of course, um, it was just brought to light and he spoke to Ariel Hawani and it seems like the UFC released him. He's four and one. It doesn't make any sense. Uh, what's going on in your eyes and uh, what do you know or what can you tell us that we don't know? Um, well, I, I can't tell you what you guys don't know because uh, that would be that would be wrong on my end. Um, mm -hmm. He was released. So, yes, that is true. He was released from the UFC. Uh, I think it, it has a lot to do with a lot of just misunderstanding between uh, what was going on. But it, it's okay. Like, it, it's not a bad thing. The second he got released, we got called up. Hey, is, is it true? Um, can, you know, is there, any, is there any way we can get him on our next fight card and whatnot? And, you know, the, the initial response to that is, well, I, it's not that, that Justin is dead set on fighting uh, for the UFC. I think it's more that Justin really, really wants to fight Ty. I think that's really what it, he he doesn't even mind taking a one fight deal. Just give me tie and I'll walk away happy. You know what I mean? So yeah, I think that's where I think that's where it is, and that's what he really 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 wants to do. And I think uh, you know if uh, if ties up for the fight, I'm sure uh, you know um, it would be an easy it would be an easy fight to make at this point. I think there's enough heat behind it for it to happen. So yeah, I think we're good. And is this one of those cases, because we saw a similar thing with Yair Rodriguez where it was announced that he was released and all of a sudden he's back. Do you believe that this could be one of those cases where we could find that Justin's back and we could see that tie fight? I, I would hope so. You know, I, my, my gut says yes, but, you know, I've seen stranger things happen where, you know, it ends up being a no. And if that's the case, we're prepared to accept that just the same. All right, so it's not something that you guys are currently discussing. Is that something you plan on bringing back up later when, when the time is right? Uh, I think timing has a lot to do with it. Uh -huh. I think timing would have a lot to do with it. And I think, well, I would say the timing for a Thai versus uh, uh, Justin fight, I think it's now, right? Like, I don't yeah. know if this fight makes sense in, in, in eight months. I think it makes sense, you know, in the next three, four months. I, uh, you know, if you announce another Thai fight between now and then, then, you know, everyone's going to say, well, why didn't you fight Justin? I think it puts a lot of pressure on uh, on on uh, Thai to accept, to accept, uh, uh, that fight. I mean, that's really, that's really where it is. I think the, the, the pressure now is let's make this fight and like kind of dead this whole thing. So in that way, okay, well, if you know, you guys have this true beef, I, I personally, I think this is good for the sport in, in a weird, 